and welcome to another Sinister Snacks. I'm your host, Laura. I'm Joel. And we're here with a very fun, very delicious looking chip snack. Uh, Lay's has their new flavors out, uh, as they like to do every year. And uh, it is Miami-inspired Cuban Sandwich. Cuban? Cuban. I love a Cubano. Yeah. And uh, the... The Cuban chips that they have at uh, all these are some of my favorite chips. I'm very excited. So I'm apprehensive, but excited. Yeah, he loves the Cuban chips at, at all these places. I do. I don't remember the brand, but they're one of my favorites. You want to you take three. the first whiff? It smells like a chip. It smells chippy. Chippy, but yeah. it does smell like porky. Because a Cuban sandwich, obviously, if you don't know what that is, it's a pork, ham, uh, panini kind of thing with, with pickles and mustard and... Um, it's delicious. If you've never had one, it's cheese. delightful. You should have one. They are so good. They're like one of our favorite sandwiches. Mm. It does right. smell good, though. Yeah. Uh, cheers, cheers before, before you, you chew. chew. Cross your fingers. Mm. Mm. Cheese and pickle. How do they do it? Magic. I'm going to say it's magic, not the gathering, just magic. Mine didn't have a ton of, of seasoning on it. Still good. Now I had a little bit more. I got to mm. try one more and then I'll make mm -hmm. my determination. This one I feel like has sufficient enough. Huh. I'm gonna go. Mm. That one had more pickly stuff on it. I lied. Four. Mm. That one. That one had a lot. It's interesting. They really do get all of the flavors in there. I taste pickle. I taste mustard. Oh, wow. Well. Mm -hmm. I do taste pork. A little bit. The, now, the flavors are a little inconsistent, like... Oh, sorry, look, the sun's out, see? Um, sun's out, gun's out. Um, sometimes it's a little bit more of one flavor than the other, but I guess that's to be, you know, if you're biting into the sandwich, it's the same situation, I suppose. I see you sneaking the chips. I had an extra one. I had mm. four. I had five. Um, <laughs> These uh, are good. But... I like them. For Lay's... It's above average, number one. Agreed. And I feel like I, I don't really have a lot of complaints. Now, if I was to compare it to the other brand, which I wish I remember the name of that, and we're going to have to close that. Um, Clancy's? Yes. It's all Those beef. are better. Those are better. Yeah. But if you see these in the store and you're like, I want some Cuban sandwich chips and they don't have an Aldi's near your house. I, I honestly can say they really what would you give them can't on a wrong. scale of one to ten? One to ten of the Cubano Chippos. Uh, I'm gonna give it a solid seven. Yeah, same, 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 same. Like a le legit same. And yeah. we don't always agree with things, but and today they definitely agree. And we don't always agree on lace for sure. All right, this was a short little video. We've got some more coming up, so stay tuned. Oh, if and you want to check us out on our other things, you can check us out at thenewlydeads.com. Uh, we're also on Tingler Television. You can watch our half-hour show. Uh, dollar Store Drive-In. Dollar Store Drive-In, um, where we talk about a dollar store movie uh, for about a half an hour. <laughs> um, and if you want more details, just go to our Facebook page uh, for the... Newly Deads, and I post um, every week. I'll post a link to the information for that particular episode, but they're all in the back archives there. Of there, so if you want to find out what time and how to get there and all that, it's in there. Or just shoot us a message at contact at thenewlydeads.com. We'll be happy to answer your questions. Yep. Uh, thanks for watching. We'll see you next week. Bye. Next time. Next week. Next time. Soon. Soon.